Hello everyone, this is Garthok, and this is my uh, three unique uh, Nile Perch rotation that I used to level when I got to the Congo. The setup I used for leveling was a Thetis 7th foot uh, 6 inch with the Leviathan 10,000 reel, 61.5 pound braid, a uh, three way rig with a 1.5 ounce uh, sinker, an offset 8 0 hook with the uh, rose and white uh, rib shad. I used the default uh, 39 inch leader length. And the locations I have here are 105.26 by 806.48 in the north part. Then 22.46 by 76.30 in the middle part of the lake. And then the final spot is the waterfall area at 81.13 by minus 887.21. I did not spend a whole lot of time by the waterfall. I usually had my net filled before I made it past the middle part. We start in the north, and I always fish at night because you fill the net very quickly. Can't say if the catch rate is better at night, it's just the way I've always fished it, and it seemed to work very well. This marker I stop at is just one I place to know where to reset my boat to. Yep, wrong button. Meant to start the engine back. You can see on the map where I got these uh, deep holes in the water. Those holes do not show up on the tablet map or on the um, blue crab bass boat or any other store-bought boat. It only shows up on the blue DLC boat and the new Congo boat. That's kind of the interesting part about the DLC boat sonars. And you want to lift your anchor up. retrieve I use is uh, twitching right at the bottom. And I will twitch it a few times as it's dropping. They do hit on the drop sometimes. And I just retrieve it right across the bottom. And they will hit right up to the boat, so don't give up too early. Usually doesn't take more than two or three casts to start getting them, so they are pretty active. except when you're, re when you're recording. Here's my first one. That's a good sign when they jump out of the water like that. It usually means it's gonna be a bigger one. All right, you can turn around now. The main advantage I use here over the waterfall area is they're not out of bounds the whole time, so you can run them down with the boat usually. But this one is determined to go out of bounds. This is not typical. <laughs> but it does happen And 
nice little trophy. I'm not going to try to get a uni at each spot because recording you'll never get them. But that is the first spot. From there I head straight south. And again with these uh, two DLC boats you'll see a deeper spot in the water that you cannot see on the tablet or the other uh, blue crab boat or the store bought boats. And I'll just stop right at the beginning of this part. So that spot does not show up here, so I put a marker at the beginning of it, which would be minus 3.29 by 122.52. And then, I suppose I should bring this one back up. 22.46 by 76.30 is my second unique spot. And again, the same retrieve. I'll twitch it as it's dropping, and then do a twitching right off the bottom. And again, right up to the boat, because they will hit all the way up to the boat. I want to hit just as it hit the bottom. Usually it'll come back like that. This one might be a unique, it looks like. That would be very lucky. He looks big. Come up one more time. I really should be using a bigger rod for demonstration purposes, but this is what I leveled with. Alright, you can turn around now. Usually they don't do this. They don't swim directly away from you this much. So, of course they'll do it while I'm recording. They want to put on a good show, I guess. It does look big though, so... Yeah, literally, they never go straight away from you every single time like this, so this is not common. It's like they know you're recording.
This is just silly. Come on. All right, Jesus. Now it's just a trophy. Yeah, I'm not using this to do the video. Yeah, that is not normal. But once in a while, you will have that. So that's the second spot, and I'm not trying that again. Then the final spot is the most popular one, the waterfall. So again, continue south. And here I'll park right up to this first buoy. And the marker I cast to is 81.13 by minus 887.21. It's a little off on an angle instead of straight out. That seems to produce pretty good fish for me. And just like the other two spots, twitch it on the way down. It's already getting hit. And twitching right across the bottom. And this one is a young, but that is where I pull a lot of uniques from. So to keep the video fairly short, I won't be trying to catch a unique at each of these locations. So one more time, the markers are at 105.26 by 806.48. And 22.46 by 76.30. And the final one's at 81.13 by minus 887.21. For you as well as they did for me while leveling. And uh, well, good luck, have fun, and I'll catch you guys next time. See you later.